Hi everybody, this is Heather and welcome to my channel. As you can tell from the title of this video, it's all about how to maintain strong and healthy hair. Oh yeah. Now, this sort of ties into how to grow it, you know, how to grow your hair. So if you like more videos like this, please click the like button and subscribe, you guys. Let's get this video started. Um, I wrote down some things right here, so if you see me looking down. <laughs> Uh, I would go, and this is not any random order, it's just like a, some simple steps that you could take to maintain or to get strong, healthy hair. So, um, this is a no-brainer. Drink lots of water. You have to drink lots of water. If you don't drink water, I'm sorry. It's. I know a lot of people, I used to be that way though still, a lot of people that don't like drinking water for some reason I guess it's tasteless they don't like that um, they like a little flavor to the water drink flavored water there's plenty of options out there where you could do to drink water to get water into your system so I know coconut water is so good I've heard that it's ten times better than water itself so that helps your hair a lot and people don't know that another step is to um, don't wash your hair often surprisingly <laughs> that is something that we don't need to do um, I know it's, it's, it's if you go to the gym every day that's a different story but make sure after washing your hair um, you replenish it give your hair um, lots of moisture condition it with a really really good conditioner to put back what you took away what you stripped away because it's not really the washing itself it's more so what you use like the shampoo shampoo strips your hair of everything the good and the bad so while you're trying to get rid of dirt and make your hair clean again you're also getting rid of a lot of good stuff for your hair and it's stripping your hair constantly making it really dry and so it's important that if you're gonna wash your hair often get a good conditioner or um, which brings me right into my next step make sure you moisturize your hair daily and um, I know in the lot community is very popular to do hot oil treatments it's um, you don't have to do it every day but um, I use castor oil in my hair every almost every day not every day but it's important to do it daily um, what I do normally is I make my own little concoction I don't have it with me it's in my bag but um, I put a little bit of peppermint oil whatever kind of oil you have and put water with it and you just shake it up and you just spritz your hair as often as you can with peppermint oil it keeps my hair smelling fresh and it just stimulates the roots to grow another tip or another step is to eat healthy it goes along with drinking water and things like that whatever you put into your body you are what you eat so it's gonna come out in your, your skin your face your your arms wherever and your hair so if you're eating good food healthy food your hair will grow strong another step is to avoid stress avoid putting yourself through unnecessary stress you know of course you have deadlines and things that you have to take care of during the week for work or whatever um you know you go in the gym that's a form of stress when you go to the gym but it's a good thing because afterwards you feel so good and revitalized and stuff but don't put yourself through unnecessary stress, stressing over, I don't know, worrying, you know, stressing over stuff that don't even need to be stressed over. You know, cut that and have meditate. Meditation is really good and yoga um, is really good. Pilates, um, that goes into, you know, going to the gym, doing something great um, where you just release a lot of stress. And I think that the when your stress levels are down, you don't have to worry about hair loss. When your stress levels are up, hair loss is a, a big thing and you don't want that to happen to you. So um, avoid stress at all times. Make sure you take your vitamins. Take good vitamins. Don't just pick up some regular generic vitamins at any um, pharmacy store or whatever. 
really do your research. Go into stuff that really works for you. But take the vitamins. Vitamins are so important. We do so many things, wear and tear, the everyday wear and tear of our bodies, and we need to replenish. And that's important with hair growth. If you, you don't have your body right, your hair is not gonna grow and, and grow with strength and healthy. Um, you need to take some good vitamins and um, one of the best type of vitamins to take is biotin because it's good for hair, skin, and nails. So it's important that you put that in your hair. So um, yeah, this is it for my list. I'm sure there's so much more, but I just chose really the top, <laughs> here are the top steps to really maintain strong, healthy hair and to get it looking like this. Oh my gosh, I haven't talked about my hair so far. I put in pipe cleaners, you guys, in my hair and it's been going strong for two weeks. It was up here and now it's dropped all the way down and it looks like waves and tight curls. I just love it. I've been getting a lot of compliments on it. So anyways, um, if you guys enjoy this video, don't forget to click the like button and subscribe. Share with your friends and your family. Love you guys. Until next time.